We didn't really talk about rooming assignments because we didn't know what the dorm would look like. I personally was trying to Google and find, you know, what does Mauer Hall look like? So if anybody is in Mauer Hall, now you're gonna know what exactly the dorm looks like. Hi everyone, my name is Aisha Koken and I'm a freshman in Mauer Hall. Mauer is a great dorm that's in a great location right next to the Phillips Brooks House and the Science Center, which is very convenient for going to classes. Currently, we're in the common room. The way the storm works is we had a double and a single, a common room and an in-suite bathroom. But at the beginning of the year, um, my roommates and I all talked about how we all wanted our individual you know, living space. And so we decided to debunk the bed and turn the double into a single and move one of the beds into the common room. At the beginning of the year, we actually divided the year into trimesters where we'd all be switching so that everyone would be in the common room. And the first trimester, I was actually in the single. And then when I switched to the uh, common room, I decided I loved it that much just because there's a lot of space, I can have friends over. So I decided to keep it for the rest of the year. We have this little divider where you can hang up coats, bags, umbrellas. We also have this bookshelf. This is a great space to just put stuff on right when you enter through the door. You can put you know, your keys, your phone. Up here, I have some pictures that I printed out. Um, my favorite color is green, so they all kind of go with the green scheme. The one thing about being in the common room is there's no closet, and so I kind of have my clothes just all scattered around. So this bookshelf has some clothes, and we all put our shoes um, to just try to keep things neat there. Over here is one of the fans that Harvard provided us, um, and here you can see the door to the bathroom. So our bathroom has one shower, which works honestly very well for three people. I've never really had to wait. Um, the shower also has surprisingly very great uh, water pressure as well. We have this little stand with three shelves, um, one for each person. And over here we have the sink um, that has three cubbies. So again, we all took one shelf. So back in the common room, you can see this is one of my roommate's bedrooms. Um, this is actually the single that I was in um, during last semester. Over here, we have a wall with just a ton of different pictures. So here are um, some of my friends from college. Here's actually one of my friends who's in Mauer Hall, shout out to Dara. And we both got housed in uh, Leverett House, which is really great. This picture here actually is from my first week at Harvard during the life pre-orientation. And we were all kind of doing a little icebreaker activity um, with my first friends at Harvard, which is crazy to think about. Um, but we were standing on top of the bridge, the Charles River Bridge, and I just saw the sunset and it looked very pretty, so I took a picture. Over here, we have one of my roommate's bedrooms. This is um, now effectively a single, so we have her closet. She has a little bookshelf with drawers. Um, over here, we have a desk and she has her bed as well. And she also has pictures, a bunch of Polaroids on the wall. So that's everything in our suite. Now I'm gonna take you down to the basement and show you a little bit what the common spaces there look like. We have a kitchen, um, a study room, and a kind of fun hangout room as well. So right now we're in the basement. Um, what's really unique about Maurer basement is that you don't have to actually exit the building to get here. You can just go down the first floor stairs. This first area is a great kitchen. We have um, a sink, we have stoves, an oven, a microwave, and a fridge. A lot of cooking has been do done down here. I made brownies with some friends. Uh, we have some ingredients that are stored in these cupboards as well, so that's great. Over here we have um, some tables where people can study at. Here's another study space. This is great for, you know, when I get sick of just studying at my desk in my room, I will come down here and get some work done. Um, there's also conveniently a printer, which is really great for when you need to print, you know, practice problems at 2 a.m. You don't have to leave the dorm. It's right here in the basement. So over here we have another common room space, um, but this one with more fun activities. So I've thrown definitely like a surprise birthday party in this area. We have um, a table and then more whiteboards here. Um, but then we also have couch and seating over here and a TV um, and a foosball table. A lot of movies have been watched on this TV. So um, a lot of fun memories have been made here. Thanks for watching. This was Mauer Hall. And if you get put into it next year, be super excited.